What's up? It's your boy Lucky Loco out here in White Swan, just chilling, man. Just want to come at you. I see a friend that's uh, fighting his second term of uh, cancer. And it made me think about uh, and appreciate the problems that I have. There's minimal problems I have compared to everybody else. I know it's it's cool to vent and it's cool to complain, but man, just be grateful that you have a solution to your problem. In many cases, some people don't have that. Some people are, you know, uh, have terminal illness, some people just got some mental health issues, uh, you know, there's certain pills that you can't take to, you know, solve these problems, and, you know, I'm just super grateful that my problems are minimal, my problems are stressful, life is stressful, but it throws a curveball at you, and it's just, uh, you just gotta learn how to deal with it. Everybody has their problems, everybody has their situations, and we're able to heal and move on. You know, there's a lot of stuff that goes on in life, but what made me think of my homeboy, it's because uh, it's his second term, his second term of uh, of cancer, throat cancer, and he he's a you know he was an MC, he he, he rapped, he, it's uh, a lot of us were in the trenches together. As crazy as it may sound, a lot of us were crazy. A lot we were talking about it. And as soon as uh, we grew up, we were all single dads. Like, we were all had problems with their baby's mom that, that they had their problems. And we had to pick up where they left off. You know, and he's still a single father. No, he's actually married now. So, you know, my other homeboy, I believe he's still a single father. Uh, I mean, we just watched, we all went from little kids to where we're at now so I just want to say a prayers to my homeboy man um, he's a trooper his father passed away from uh, almost the same thing you know uh, he's got a lot of family out there it's just uh, a lot of friends um, very loved guy man he's uh, I can't there's not anything I can say about him I mean we've done stuff in the streets we had our little beefs here and there but there's nothing I could think of to say that, you know, of any track record I can say, man, this dude, you know. Well, you know, even with this situation, like I said, I just can't come, can't come up with an idea of <laughs> why I would dislike the guy, why anybody would dislike the guy. So, he's just one of them cool dudes, man, and I appreciate it. Just remember, man, it's cool. It's cool to have our problems and to deal with it, but just remember, be grateful the problems that we have is somebody else's solution too at times. Uh, we all go through it and it's a, it's a rough situation, man. And I pray that he comes through and and gets out of it, man. And uh, I'll keep you updated on this situation he's in. He's in the hospital right now, but we'll see. I inboxed him earlier. Much love and respect, you guys.